Welcome to my channel. I am uh, known as Kicks Codes on Instagram, and this is actually my first YouTube video because I got so many questions about like who I am and what I've done before. So I wanted to just explain everything to you because I moved to Germany now from Sweden when I started the account, and now it's been the first week of university. So it's been a lot to do and I know you guys have waited for this video so here it comes so my name is Christina and uh, that's my real name and my account is called Kix Codes because Kix is my nickname that I had since I was a child and my sister actually gave it to me and I'm currently 25 years old I'm from Sweden but I moved to Munich to start studying and as you know it says X data scientist on my Instagram account is because I worked with that before for over a year and then I decided to move to Munich to start studying at the Technical University. So the main question that a lot of you have asked me is why X data scientist? Like why do I study now and then might become a data scientist again? And it was mainly because I didn't evolve more. Uh, I would not say that the machine learning, deep learning market in Stockholm is that evolved. So some of the projects I did while I was working as a data scientist at one of the big consulting firms was like sometimes not 100% AI related. And I would not say that there were a lot of experts within the field that I could learn from. So I really, really wanted to like deep dive into it. Uh, so my options were like changing company or actually like studying uh, because I just did my bachelor before. Uh, so for me, it was kind of natural to choose a master within machine learning now. Uh, so I could like talk with other peers uh, that are also interested. I could be close to research where people are really on the edge uh, in the field. So I think that will give me more than just like going to another company and hoping that there will be a lot of knowledgeable people there because it is a kind of a new field. So we have to be aware of that. And the second question I get the most is like, how can you become a data scientist? And I mean, there's so many paths uh, to it. Um, I would say that you can have a physics background, a computer science background, or like a math background, and all of those will like fit really good. You just have to really know your basics and your linear algebra. Um, like you can't be scared of maths if you're a, like a computer science major, for example. You really need to like math still. And if you are a physics, have a physics background, you have to learn more about like Python and like parallel computing because you will do a lot of those kind of setups uh, working as a data scientist. Uh, so yeah, math, statistics, like different regression analysis, uh, you have to know Python most in most of the cases. I would really recommend if you do have the option at your university uh, to learn about deep learning and machine learning actually and taking those classes. Um, if you don't have that option, you can learn online. I did most of my knowledge I got uh, from online. I would definitely recommend like Coursera or I would also say that you should definitely check out YouTube. Uh, there's so many, so many, so many tutorials about neural networks or machine learning or if you need a refreshment within linear algebra, all of that is there. And if you then feel that you want to do something more practical, because you will not become a good data scientist if you just do like the theoretical part, you have to actually do a lot of the different kind of analysis and computations, if it's images, the big data sets you want to do. I would definitely recommend checking out Kaggle.com, which is like a big platform for data scientists. And there, there are challenges. So they actually provide you with data sets and you are able to make like your own trainings with that data and compete with others. And that is what will make you a good data scientist because you will be able to come to an interview and you will be able to like really show projects that you've done. 
And also, like, I really do believe in learning by doing. So I would definitely, definitely, definitely recommend you to, like, start, like, experimenting on your own. There's so many free data sets out there. Another thing that I would like to add is that, like, don't uh, be afraid to apply to those kind of positions. I mean, I only had a bachelor. Uh, I done the math part and I done some computer vision classes. Like, I took some master courses in my bachelor. I was like... If you actually just want it, then you will get it. Like you will sit all the evenings at home and studying and like reading the books, doing the YouTube tutorials, like doing the different challenges online. Because like if there is a will, like you're definitely gonna make it. So just like whatever background you have, like just go for it. Okay, that was uh, all I had for today. Like I wanted to focus mostly on and my curious of data scientists because that's what you asked mostly about uh, and maybe I'll do a more personal one if you want that later on uh, otherwise I just want to thank you so much for watching and supporting me on Kids Codes on Instagram like you guys are seriously amazing it's so much fun writing with you and like replying to your comments it really makes my day and please subscribe here down below uh, because I will surely post more videos. So if you don't want to miss them, uh, please subscribe. It will really support me. Um, bye. Really love you guys.